Here's why it might seem like you've gained weight in your face. This should go without saying, but sometimes it needs repeating. You are amazing the way you are. That said, if you want to change something about the way you look, whether it's your hair color or number on the scale, as long as it's healthy, that's a personal choice. If you found yourself Googling how to lose weight in your face, you've come to the right place. Keep track of your calories. Weight Loss 101 If you burn more calories than you take in, you'll generally lose weight, in your face and other areas. Counting calories may be a useful tool for some individuals to lose weight because it helps them become more aware of the foods they are eating, says Carrie Gons, R.D., author of The Small Change Diet. Everyone's calories needs are different, but you can get a good idea of what yours could be with this body weight planner from the National Institutes of Health, NIH. It has you enter in basic information like your height, age, weight, physical activity, and desired weight, and then gives you recommended daily calorie counts based on your goals. Check your medications. Some medications have a rep for causing puffiness. Certain medications such as corticosteroids or AC inhibitors and ARBs for high blood pressure can cause a face to be puffy, Gans says. If you've noticed your face looking fuller after starting a new medication and it bothers you, talk to your doctor to see if you have other options. Make sure you're getting enough fiber. Fiber is a nutrient found in fruits, vegetables, and whole grains, and it does a few things that can help with weight loss. Foods rich in fiber, such as oats, legumes, fruit, and vegetables, may help improve digestive issues, such as bloating, gas, and constipation, Gans says. It can also help fill you up more and for longer periods of time, lowering the risk that you'll do mindless snacking, Cording says. Rethink your workouts. Of course, exercise can help you lose weight, Matheny says. You will be burning calories and expending energy. But, he says, if you're taking in more calories than you're burning, you will not lose weight. Aim to consistently do at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity exercise a week and try adding some lifting to your workouts if you're not doing it already, he says. Keep tabs on your sodium intake. Having high levels of sodium can cause water retention and puffiness in your face, Keatley says. By reducing sodium in your diet, you help your body maintain a proper balance of fluids leading to a slimmer face. A good place to start if you're unsure is having no more than 2,300 milligrams of sodium each day, the recommended limit from the dietary guidelines for Americans. Drink more water. Water helps with a number of things that can lead to weight loss in your face, per cording. It helps fiber take up space in your stomach so you feel full, she says. The water itself also helps you to feel full, which lowers the risk of snacking mindlessly. Dehydration can also cause your body to hold on to more water, leading to swelling in the process, Gan says. If you stay hydrated, this may help prevent it. If you're unsure if you're hydrated enough, check your pee. It should be a pale yellow color. Aim for at least seven hours of sleep a night. Lack of sleep can mess with hormones like ghrelin that regulate your hunger cues, upping your risk of overeating. If you sleep well, you're less likely to overeat, Cording says. As for how much sleep you should get, the general recommendation is seven or more hours a night for most adults, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC. Limit how much alcohol you drink. Alcohol can increase your risk of dehydration, and that can cause your face to puff up, Cording says. The Dietary Guidelines for Americans recommend that women have no more than one drink a day and that men have no more than two drinks a day. But alcohol impacts everyone differently. If you notice you tend to look puffy the day after you have a drink and it bothers you, it's worth considering how much you drink. Focus on eating a balanced diet. A balanced diet is key for a healthy lifestyle and to aid in weight management, Gans says. Focus more on eating 100% whole grains, fruit, veggies, nuts, seeds, legumes, seafood, and staying hydrated to help meet your goals. A good hack per cording if you feel like it's a struggle to eat enough fruits and vegetables. Fill half your plate with plants and build your meal from there. Try to manage your stress levels. Yep, stress can mess with the way your face looks. Chronic stress can lead to hormone imbalances, such as increased cortisol levels, which can cause weight gain and facial puffiness, Keatley says. Incorporating stress reduction techniques like meditation, yoga, or deep breathing can help alleviate stress and promote a slimmer facial appearance.